In this video, I will show you how to update Xcode command line tools on your Mac. So if you have updated your operating system, you may find that once you try to do certain things, you will get a message like this. It tells us that we have an invalid active developer path. And what we can do to update this is simply run a code in our terminal. So if you open up your terminal application, and I'm going to clear the screen just to make this a little bit easier to see. And before we get into this, I should say that this video is based on you having previously installed Xcode command line tools. So if you've never installed Xcode or Xcode command line tools, then this tutorial might not work for you. But if you have and you've recently updated your operating system, then it's very likely that all you need to do is update these tools. So within terminal, let's type in the following command, Xcode dash select with a space, then a double hyphen and the word install. And once you run that code, you will get this prompt that comes up and asks us, do we want to download the command line tools? So once we hit the install button, it will start to download the files that we need. So first of all, we need to agree to this license agreement. If you do not have your computer plugged into the power outlet, then you will normally get a notification like this. So I'll just connect my power and then I will hit the continue button. So now we can see that the software has started to download and this will only take two or three minutes, um, but it's perfect time to just step away and make some coffee or do whatever you need to do. But after a few minutes, this should be finished downloading. So I've skipped forward a few minutes just to speed this up. Now that it has completed the installation, we should be able to run the same command again and this time not get this warning. So I'm gonna try and run this git status and you'll see this time that we do not get this warning and the installation was successful. So that's it for this video. Hopefully this has been helpful to you guys. And if it has, make sure to like that video and subscribe for more upcoming videos. And I will see you all in the next one.